Hey. Dean. I feel a little left out over there. Let's get over. I said to come along. These are my friends. My friends who don't listen very well. You sure you're all right? Yes. Are you? I'm fine. What have you done? It's a means to an end. Damn it, Dean. Cass, is there anything specific we should know about your friend? All right. Guys, you know what? This, this silent treatment thing, it's silly. It's not going to work. Whatever we're walking into, we should, you know, probably have an actual plan. <sighs> what do you want to know? Oh, he speaks. Uh, enough. He could be an agent or something. Yeah, maybe a third tier agent. At least they don't look like a lumberjack. Okay, enough. Look, Benjamin wouldn't call for help lightly, and he wouldn't put himself in harm's way if he could help it. Wow, this Benjamin seems like he's pretty cool. You know, like he wouldn't make any half-cocked, knee-jerk choices. Yeah, you know what I like about him is that he's sarcastic, but he's thoughtful and appreciative, too. What was that supposed to mean? Okay, okay. The wrong, wrong. What are you, crazy? I will kill for this! I give everything for you. And this is what you give to me. I got your message. It was long, your message. I find the sound of your voice grating. Are you... drunk? No. Yes. What the hell happened to you? I found a liquor store. And? And I drank it. Riddle me this, boy wonder. Why do you need the wheels? When you betray us, I'll be the one to carve out your heart. Are you okay? Don't ask stupid questions. No one's even seen God. The whole thing remains mysterious. The hell does that mean? What part of I don't know escapes your understanding? Where the hell have you been? On a bender. He's, did you say on a bender? Yeah, he's still pretty smashed. Actually. It is not of import. Guess. Look, if Sam calls, you answer. Okay, you wing your ass down here and you tell him, I don't know. But just because we have some sort of a, a bond or whatever. You think I came because you called? And where's the pie? I think we're out. You don't understand. I need pie. Put the virgin down, Castillo. I need your help. That's rich, really. Sam, Dean, my people skills are rusty. Pardon me, but I have spent the last year as a multi-dimensional wavelength of celestial intent. But believe me, you do not want that weapon down. Well, he puts the ass in cares, huh? He's definitely off. You know, I can hear you both. I am a celestial being. They won't take long. You don't know that. They may find more wayward orphans along the way. Oh, don't get cute. Right. Pardon me for highlighting their crippling and dangerous empathetic response with sarcasm. But you're just mad because you're only my second choice for a Lucifer Hunt team up. No, actually, I think it's sweet. I thought your motivation was ambition and revenge, but now I know you just want to save your mother. It's not about saving her. Lucifer has made off with a colossally powerful witch who, by the way, is the only person alive who can slam him back in the... I'll search the town. Give me a moment. Guess we can still see you. <clears throat> when 
now it just looks like you're pooping. I'm powerless. You're joking. So it's Eve. So wait, mom's making you limp? Figuratively, yes. Let's go. Shotgun. Uh, wrong. You're in the back. Hey, you too. Keep an eye on him. What's the leg? You're on my side. Hey, hey, hey! Without your power, you're basically just a baby in a trench coat. <laughs>